Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. In today's video, I have a ton of cleaning motivation in every room of the house. So rather you need to do your standard typical clean or you need to do a deep clean in some areas, I have that in today's video just for you. So put me up on your TV screen and we can clean together and tackle this mess. <laughs> When you have the whole house to clean, what room do you typically start in? For me, it's usually the master bedroom so then I can get a load of laundry started while I start cleaning other areas of the house. I'm really curious though, like do you normally start whatever room is in the messiest condition or what's your process? I'm really curious. Comment down below. <laughs> If you're wondering on why the outfit change no it is not a different day the humidifier apparently had old musty water in it and it spilled all over my pant leg that was fun this video was however filmed in three different days this outfit change though is still day one This hallway usually only needs vacuumed, but the reason for all this stuff is from painting the nursery. It's now painted. I definitely need to go through some of this stuff as I won't be keeping it all. 
that however is a project for another day so right now out of sight out of mind i'm so excited that the nursery is finally painted now i can start shopping for all the fun stuff and pick a theme i believe i have mentioned it in another video but i will be doing a full video from start to finish all about little man's nursery and i am so excited polish the faucet i'm using the sponge just to get it wet and then adding some barkeeper's friend to a sponge this is going to help remove any water spots and really just polish it up this is my first time using barkeeper's friend any multi-purpose spray will work just as well for this like i said this is my first time using it i was really excited to try it out you will see a major before and after with my shower in just a moment using dawn power wash and the barkeeper's friend so keep Keep watching for that clip. Let's talk. Are you at the avenue? I don't need nobody else but me. It doesn't matter what you're gonna say. I just need time right now. I'm going alone through night. I don't need nobody else but me. But I'm thinking about the way you. I know I didn't fill it up, not the most aesthetically pleasing soap refill. I bought a three pack of these giant pump bottles from Sam's Club right before purchasing this reusable soap pump. So I'm trying to get through the bulk purchase from Sam's Club before I can fill it with my favorite, which is the Myers brand soap. I don't need nobody else but me. It doesn't matter what you're gonna say I just need time right now I'm going alone tonight I don't need nobody else but me But I'm thinking about the way you
have a particular order of how you clean the toilet. I did the inside bowl first, then I did the exterior of the toilet. Normally, I do the exterior and then the bowl. I don't think that there's really any particular or right way to do it, but I thought it was kind of funny that I switched it up. I didn't even realize it until now when I'm editing this that I don't normally do it that way. But of course, now I'm curious, do you have a specific order of how you do this? Let me know down below in the comments. Here are some before and after clips of my shower. I did not film myself cleaning it for two reasons. One, I didn't want this video to be too long and two, I always find it easier to clean the shower while I'm in the shower. Showering. <laughs> It can be a pretty messy and gross job, so just knowing that I can wash my body right after doing it makes me feel a lot better and more motivated to actually clean it. Also, the steam from the water makes it a much easier job to do. While in the shower, I used Dawn Power Wash on the doors, and for the orange soap scum at the floor, I used the Barkeeper's Friend. It was honestly so easy to get everything cleaned off, and I'm just gonna say it, I hate this shower so much. Glass doors are impossible to keep clean and looking nice, and I want a bathtub so badly. One day, we will replace this shower, just not a major priority at this time.
so now i am vacuuming the floor so i can get it prepped and ready to go for me to be able to carpet clean i underestimated how long it takes to carpet clean a rug this was my first time doing this so i do think i probably could have gone a little bit faster but i just wanted to do it right so i really took my time it took me like an hour to do this rug <laughs> It doesn't need to take that long, but I did get some good results, which of course I feel like look much better in person than they did on camera, but that's aside from the point. I know it's much cleaner and just wait till you see the dirty water. There were clumps of dog hair, which was just amazing to me because I really thought that I vacuumed up all of the dog hair and the carpet cleaner found more. Side note, this carpet cleaner will be linked below. Anything I ever use in a video is always linked in the description box. I told you that water is disgusting and then the clumps of dog hair coming out of it too. Ooh. Towards the end of what seems like every week, our house is flooded with Amazon boxes. Steve and I both do our fair share of online shopping, and this is pretty typical for what the house looks like around this time. I believe this was filmed on Friday, and don't worry, I definitely recycled all of those boxes. And I stay humble, hit me for a feature, don't you come with no petty numbers Talking about some leverage, but you been had plenty from us Fed you for the low so I could dub when the any come And you can't take a penny from us For a court press, Bobby Knight with my attitude You wouldn't understand, so I can't be mad at you You ever had to roll coins to get to the next week Working for the ten, had to rush to the ten and so What you know about that? And that made me a better man now it's backstage business to shake your hands. I don't do this for Instagram. Speaking of shopping, I also went to Target and Dollar Tree earlier this week. I pretty much just picked up cleaning supplies. A lot of things I've had in mind or have just been curious to try for the channel. So definitely we'll have a video on all of these things coming soon. Okay, okay. You may be wondering why there is no kitchen cleaning content in this video. Two reasons. One, again, I didn't want this video to be too long. And two, next week's video, I will be doing everything in the kitchen. I have lots of decluttering, lots of organizing, and of course, cleaning and deep cleaning. The whole shebang. That will be next week's video. I am very excited to tackle the mess that is going on in that kitchen. If you aren't already, you should definitely hit that subscribe button. And if you have already subscribed to my channel thank you so much i gained 
10 subscribers in this last week and it motivates me so much to put out more content if you have made it this far go ahead and give this video a like and as always i will see you next monday with a brand new video and i hope you all have a great rest of your week Never ending Can't give you what you need Oh no